Hey everyone, I'm Rajiv from DevCode and in this video, I will continue the previous video where I told you all about promises in JavaScript. So in this video, I'm going to tell you all about the then and catch methods used to manage promises in JavaScript. The then method of the promise object takes up two arguments, one for callback functions for the full fit cases and the other for rejected cases of the promise. It immediately then returns an equivalent promise object, allowing us to chain calls to the other promise methods. The catch method schedules a function to be called when a promise is rejected. It also returns an equivalent promise object allowing us to chain calls to other promises just like the then method. Now, as you saw that the then method can also be used to handle errors or rejections just like the catch method. Now this can create some doubt about when to use which. So let me just tell you that. The then method should be used for the fulfilled promises and the catch method should be used only for the rejections, if you are the type of person who might get confused seeing then method having two parameters, or the same can be done in the case of creating a clean yet understandable code. Now you will say, Rajiv, why do we have a choice if then method can perform both the jobs as you can see in the example? And the answer to that is sometimes you might need a method which is required for just handling errors or rejections. So that's the reason for having both methods available. Well, this is it for this video. Bye.